Hello, Internet. Welcome. Malik, I'm in the hive. What's your plan? Oh. Find Lee and talk to him. I want you to convince him you know exactly what he did to Evelyn and why. If you can make him panic, I'm willing to bet he'll spill his guts. Just make it look like blackmail. If he's willing to pay to keep you quiet, he's basically tying his own noose. I'll listen in and record everything. Got it. That's quite easy, actually. Cool plan. Let's do it. Like your sunglasses, man. Are you walking the streets of Lower City alone, my friend? Even those military class augments won't save you if you're not careful. Don't worry. I'm always careful. Where would I find the guy, huh? Maybe up here? Nope. He's here with a girl, I know that much. Those are two ladies. This guy's all alone. Lee, there we go. Hello there. What do you want, Chrome Boy? Is your name Lee Hong? Yeah, maybe it is, maybe it isn't. What's it to you? I want to talk to you about Evelyn Carmichael. Ev... Man, it's off! I already told all you narcos all there is to say. Relax. I'm not with the police. I work private. And you could say I specialize in cases like yours. If you ain't police, then what the fuck you want? A simple proposition. I have proof that shows you murdered Evelyn. And I want you to pay me two and a half million credits to make that proof disappear. Two and a half? Bullshit. You ain't got shit on me, Narco. I ain't paying you shit. I strongly suggest you reconsider. And I strongly suggest you get the fuck out of my face. Because unless you got your proof right here, I ain't got shit to say to you. Alright. Let's start with the police report. I know your story doesn't match up with the evidence at the scene of Evelyn's fall. Oh yeah? And why's that? Because the police report itself was falsified. Why else would that be, if not to cover up a weak alibi? Man, you gotta be kidding me. That's some weak ass shit right there. Not only does the evidence not add up, but neither does your testimony. You lied about why Evelyn fell down the stairs in the first place. You said Evelyn was high as a kite, drugged out of her mind when she died. But we both know this isn't true. I barely remember what I said that night, but I know that ain't it. Now, if the evidence doesn't fit and your story was a lie, then how did Evelyn die on that night? Well, the answer is pretty simple, really. You killed her. But how? By hitting her in the head with that antique clock you keep so prominently displayed in your apartment. The lacerations on her head, the intracranial hemorrhaging, it's the perfect match. In my apartment? How the fuck do you know what's in my apartment? And like any good crime of passion, you needed motivation. Something to fuel your violent outbursts. What did Evelyn say or do to make you murder her? She told you she was pregnant and you panicked. Faced with the prospect of losing your easy way of life, you struck out at her in anger. How? That's impossible. But now the final piece of the puzzle. Why was Evelyn's death never considered a murder investigation? Because your family, one of the wealthiest and most influential families in Shanghai, covered it up. But whose silence did they buy? Hmm. 
Hmm. That's both true, actually. Bell Tower. Your family's sizable investments in Bell Tower assured they would turn a blind eye to any of your run-ins with the law, no matter how serious. Fuck this shit, man! And, and fuck you! I can help you, Lee. But only for a price. Alright, fuck! I can't believe this shit! I'll pay you, man! I'll pay you just... What do you need from me? Details. Let me hear your side of the story, and then we'll move on from there. I don't... I don't know! Evelyn, that stupid bitch! She was going to ruin me. I... I didn't mean to kill her, okay? Evelyn wouldn't shut up about us, about the baby, so I hit her! I just wanted to make her shut her stupid mouth. But the dumb bitch started freaking out. So I hit her again and, until I... Until she finally stopped screaming. When I realized what I'd done, I, I panicked. She was barely breathing, so I carried her to the stairs near my apartment and, and dropped her. I had to make sure it looked like an accident. I had no choice! She trapped me! She just wanted my money. I would have been ruined. I need to go. We'll be in contact again soon. Huh? What? What about the evidence? And the money? Where the fuck you going? Goodbye, Lee. Oh, oh, oh. Alec, please tell me you got a recording of all that. Oh my god, Jensen, I could kiss you right now. Yeah. I can't believe you got him to confess so openly like that. To be honest, it was easier than I was expecting. You were definitely right about Lee. He's not exactly the sharpest tool in the shed. Well, don't get too cocky just yet. Before I send our little friend's confession off to the local media and authorities, I want to get some Shanghai street justice first. There's a control panel linked to the hive I need you to hack. Uploading the coordinates now. What? Like, listen. But I really want that kiss afterwards. Do you know that? Uh, where is that? It's over there. There's like security people everywhere. Ah, great. I knew someone was here. Kill you. Uh-oh. Damn it. Whoa, whatever happened here? Holy shit, man.
Okay, hold it. I mean, what's going on, really? You've got to be kidding. Holy shit, what have I done? I you're here. Yeah, I'm here. How many security people does this place have? Ah, they got me totally cornered. Come out. 
and we'll finish this. Are you? God damn it. Mayla? Shoot down the whole place Mayla? or what? Who is Mela? the signal come on come on okay I'm in remote frequencies are clear thank God uploading now and done meet me in front of the hive Jensen I have a little surprise for our friend Lee yeah well uh, Mila. vodka well, I got a little surprise for um uh, For my record, man. It's okay. Yeah, it's okay. It's Mayla. Mayla. Whoa. I mean, I like totally killed everyone. All the security people in the whole place. Mayla. Mayla. Who is Mayla? I have no idea. Hi guys. I have no idea what's going on. Wasn't me. Holy shit. How come like no one turned up like police bell tower. The fucking army. I just killed like I don't know 12, 14, 15 security people. <coughs> Oh, hi there. Good to see you again, sir. Go right in. Oh, okay. I will. Just checking. What's going to happen if I go back in? Everybody going like, oh, yeah, he's got a card. Hi, guys. Ah, uh, looks like the club got shot up. Okay. Um... Maybe I'm not going to show my face here so soon. On the other hand, I don't think anybody really saw my face. I hacked it and then I jumped into cover. Where is Malik? Holy shit. Jensen. Malik. Well, first take this. I was going to use it myself, but after everything you've done, I think you deserve it more. So what are you going to do now? I have a few loose ends to tie up, and I need to make sure this autopsy report finds its way into the right hands. The Hongs aren't going to buy their way out of this one. Lee's confession is solid. With that and the evidence from the autopsy, there's no way he can avoid prosecution. Justice will be served. Oh, justice will be served, all right. You might want to stick around for a second. I've got one last little surprise for our friend Lee. Okay. Are you facing the hive? It's almost showtime. In three, two. Malik. Just watch. I don't. I don't know. Evelyn, that stupid bitch. She was going to ruin me. I. I didn't mean to. Evelyn would shut up about us. About the way Malik, remind me never to piss you off. After everything you've done here for Evelyn, for me. You'd have to try pretty hard, mister. Okay. 
let's check my quest log, but it seems... Yeah. Finished quests. The quest is finished, I guess. Killing all these people. No problem. Main quests. Side quests. Um, here. Face the hive exterior. I finished it. Killing all those security people? No problem. I wonder what I should have done. Like, um, I, I don't know. Like, sneak up there and do it all quietly or so. I don't know. Oh, well. I think people will, uh, respect me now. <laughs> Since Bell Tower is after me anyway, who cares? All right, ladies and gentlemen. It was a strange way of solving it, but I solved it. Very violently, but I did. By signing off.